guys. Okay, got a little explaining to do, and sorry I haven't made a video in a, a minute. Um, not gonna go into like huge details and stuff. It's not necessary, but I changed job. Well, not change change my hours during the job. My girlfriend has a new job, and it's kind of hard to get a video going and doing that all, you know, getting that all done. So, in the meantime, though, I did get a video yesterday of Chase Man. He's one of my um, clients slash, well, not, he's a client, yes, and I've helped him out with the program and getting him set up for this meet. Uh, I think he did very well. This is his second meet only in his entire life. He's in one. He weighed in 198 or 196 actually, and um, he totaled 1550 at 198. Uh, only got 565 on squat, 410 on bench, and 575 on deadlift. It wasn't the greatest day, nor was it the greatest meet. I will say. Uh, not all of his fault. I will say um, the meat itself was not that great, if you know what I mean. Like it wasn't ran very well. Uh, it was a little bit dis disorganized. Um, the rack was completely awful. They should have used a, a squat bar, not a not a power bar, because it didn't give anybody enough room to walk out. And you'll see here, like half of the time, uh, even even when he walked out pretty clean, the, the one he did get, um, it was still just the rack was coming off. There was a guy that squatted 680 there, and I mean, every time he unracked it, half the rack went with him. It was not the best thing. And um, without a doubt, I will most likely never compete in the APA meet after seeing that. Unfortunately, not to say, you know, I'm not sure every APA is like that, you know, but it just wasn't good, you know, it just wasn't that great. So, I think his performance was affected by the squats. Uh, it didn't affect him on bench, but man, it did affect him on deadlift, definitely. Uh, this guy squatted 585 for a triple in training. He, I mean, he was deadlifting 585, benching 365 for multiple reps and sets. He was definitely on peak straight out of the gate, ready to go for this meet. He's on track. The unfortunate part about this was everything didn't help him, basically. But I also told him not everything's going to go perfect. Not everything is going to be the way it needs to be. Not every meet's perfect. So... I thought he did fantastic, not only fantastic, but phenomenal for a second meet in dealing with the conditions he dealt with. So, other than that, not trying to make excuses on what, you know, why he didn't perform the way, you know, we were we were both wanting, but he got over it, it's okay, because he came out with four state records and an elite total. So, you can't ask for anything better than that. So, uh, I... Without further ado, I'm going to get this video started, and you guys can see his squat, bench, and deadlift, and please, please stay tuned. I will get videos out more often. I'm trying my best to figure out a good time schedule. Other than that, I'm, you know, we'll see where things go. All right, guys. Stay strong. Stay headstrong. Bye. In the hall. Okay, Justin has already set a state record today with 600. Now he's going to break his own record. He's going to attempt to hear with 625. Come on! Let's lock Get it! Get it. Come on! Come on. Six five for Chase Man, Justin Richardson and Dip, Justin Lowe in the home.
step forward. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Go! 